Following breaking news this morning in West Hartford, more than a handful of families are without a home right now after an overnight fire. Pinpoint News Tracker shows us where it happened at the Westwood Condos on Kane Street. Channel 3 Eyewitness News reporter Carolina Cruz is live there. What are the latest details we know now, Carolina? The latest details are that folks are being let back inside these condos. So we know that firefighters wanted to wait until it was a little bit light out just because power has not been restored here just yet. We can see where the fire started, though, now that, again, it's light out. We're getting also a look at the damage. You can see that right here on your screens. Flames were shooting out of these windows earlier and quickly spreading toward the upper levels. Firefighters, they requested backup, and with that additional help, they managed to contain the fire. The majority of the folks here, they self-evacuated. Others only managed to get out because neighbors and first responders were knocking on their door this morning. My advice is, is if you hear a fire alarm, leave the building. Uh, regardless of whether there's some with burned food or it could be, you know, whatever, but then it could be this. We could have uh, a fire in the building and you need to get out. So the advice is, is if you hear the fire alarm, please leave the building. It makes our job a whole lot easier, like it did tonight. We're a community, we're a neighborhood, we're, you know, we, we share a building and first and foremost, hopefully everyone's okay. Second of all, watching smoke spread my direction, as selfish as it is, I'm obviously a little concerned for my unit as well. We know that everyone made it out okay. Some of these units are vacant, so that also helped first responders. About eight to 10 units though, they were impacted by water, smoke and fire damage. We know the Red Cross is on scene and they will be helping those families. Investigators are also on scene as far as police and fire marshals and they will be investigating that cause and we'll post updates to our Channel 3 app. Reporting in West Hartford, I'm Carolina Cruz, Channel 3 Eyewitness News.